Hello! Welcome to another episode of our Animal Crossing New Horizons Adventures. Let's see what Isabel has to say in today's announcements. Hello there, everyone. Right now on Talafofo is 2.56 p.m. on Monday, March 30th, 2020. Now for today's announcements. We have a new friend on our island. Let's give a big Talafofo welcome to Jacques. He was a bird. He was a birdie do, A burb. Jacques, on behalf of your new island family, welcome aboard. That's all for today. Have a fun day out there. Man. Every morning, Isabel, with that whiskey. <laughs> That's too funny. The phone is ringing. Oh, Timmy and Tommy. Give my money. Give my money. Alrighty. Let's check the mail. Got a whole bunch of stuff. I got another Nintendo Switch. Pretty, pretty pricey. Let's get all this stuff. I went through and I, um, I know it doesn't look like it, but I kind of sifted through some of the mail. Alrighty. So this is all from, um, the... A, B, D, so nothing cray cray. K, K, Milonga. Milonga. Present. Alright. Wind turbine, yes. Tourist telescope, yes. Outdoor bench, outdoor bench. Oh, okay. I can use that. Um, first thing I want to do is go inside. I'm going to put um, KK Milonga in the radio. Let's see what it sounds like. I kind of like that. I, I'm digging that. Oh, I like that. I'm keeping that for a little bit. I got my sporty shades, which I will put on. Oh yeah, nah. Let's see. I think I just bought this to fill out the catalog so Nintendo switch so let's put that away outdoor bench mm. we'll put that away for now um yeah and I'm just gonna sell that cool uh, that microphone in the middle I got that from a, a balloon and I just do it in there all right we got Tabs doing some, some yoga, some uh, afternoon yogurt. I put up my fountain, and I put up a light post. I'm gonna. I don't want to, cause it's gonna be very tedious. But I'm gonna have to um, move this whole setup because I have decided that this is where I want to put the little park area that I have in mind. And we can see here, with my shovel of power, got a fossil, a fusums, and I see a branch over here. This thing is finally growing. I moved it over one square. Now, a lot of people might have already done this, but I'm stealing this from my brother. That's because makes sense you know why why not um have a telescope that can see out here i never see like fish 
spawn out here or anything like that. Oh, you know, man, that bench probably would be good right here. Maybe right there. Dang. Oh, well, I'll take care of that later. Wind turbine. Um, I'm wanting to put that on the highest point of the island. I see a DIY recipe in a bottle. Let's see, this is from Graham. I don't know who Graham is. While rereading my diary the other day, I came across this recipe. Ah, I never cease to amaze myself. And now you, and only you, get to reap the benefits of my brilliance. Now bring my genius to life. Ironwood chair. Oh, okay. Another, um... Another one for the Ironwood, uh, Ironwood series. That goes along with um, this. No, it doesn't. I thought it did. I thought it went with these. Huh. Let me see. Well. Oh, I do have something Ironwood. Okay. So I have an Ironwood kitchenette. Okay. I need to build this. Because Tom Nook keeps telling me, he's like, put stuff on the island. And um, just to show something that I've done, uh, or a few things that I've done, you saw the um, where I want to put that park area. Um, so I have that fountain, I have that one street light. I'm going to, as soon as I move everything, um, it's going to be the fountain in the middle. And then four street lights on the corners. And then benches as well. And that's why I'm kind of hoping I get all of that, um, what's it called? The paving tool where I can put down paths and stuff like that. That way um, it can really bring the, the park to life. Um, so yeah. Got a fossil up here. Um, you can see up here, um, this was something... I kind of took from Breath in the Wild, Breath of the Wild, um, on the top of, on the very top of the peak, on the plat, the Great Plateau, there's a rock that is, um, that has been hinted at of being King Rome's grave. Um, now, in the, now I got this mossy stone from the ABD. The Nook Miles stuff, and um, I thought it'd be a lot bigger than that, but I decided to go with it. So that kind of reminded me of that grave site in Breath of the Wild. So I just kind of put it up here, put some torches. So yeah. Um, let's see something else. I planted a few more. Ooh stick I planted a few more flowers that's what I did but before I get to that I want to show you what I did I bought a lot of things off of the Nook Miles program catalog ooh are those pink sorry distractions I just, I, I gotta know. I gotta know. Oh, they're just red. Get out of here. Get out of here. Um, this right here. I got a stone arch. This depleted my stone supply. So that is something that I need to work back up because this thing took a lot of stone to make. Not only that, but in order to build this, you had to build, um, oh no, I'm thinking of the fountain. The fountain took a lot of stone. And before you can build this, the fountain, you had to build a bird bath, not a bird bath, a drinking fountain, which that took a lot of stone. So that's even more stone right here. I think this did take um, a lot of stone as well. I guess I have it right here, I can show you. So you can see 30, no, 20 pieces of stone. This one needs eight. So that's already 28 pieces of stone for these two. And then I, I built that, which this took 15. I built this. This is 90 
pieces of stone. 90. Oh my gosh. And I guess they're edging the grass right now. So, sorry about that. That's what's going to be in the background. I can do nothing about it. I see a rock right here. Um, let me get this while I'm here. And I do see that little glowing spot. And I'm getting stones, which now I am kind of wanting. Hey, gold nugget. I'm cool with that too. That's like everything I need. I'm, I'm still kind of sitting pretty with iron. But you know, who? you never know um, when you might need those for a future uh, build. And look, Pico started doing... Pico started doing yogurt with tabs. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Let's see. DIY projects, chop wood, a red snapper. That shouldn't be too bad. And that's 800. Dang. Redeem Nook Miles. I can do that. I can buy another ticket. Um, You can see my Nook Miles. I did spend a lot of Nook Miles at the ATM. I'm going to dig this up. Um... Let me put that away. And this will kind of be a test. If I bury this. So that means it's supposed to be, whenever it fully grows, it's supposed to give me three 10,000 bags. So I guess the experiment will be when it grows, once I pick a place for it to grow. Um. Let's put it. Hey! That's a pink rose. No, oh, poopy. Um Look! Oh my gosh, that's so awesome. Let's put it let's put it right here. And this will be like the test. Oh, where'd it go? Oh my gosh, that's not where I wanted it. Nope. Um. Oh, this this right here. Perfect. Perf. Plant. There we go. That'll do. Um. If it'll still grow, even though I moved it. I like to think that it would, but you never know. Another gold nugget, please. Please, pretty please. No, that's okay. I got stones, and I'm kind of happy with that at the moment. So, yesterday, fun day. Um, finally caught that coelacanth I've been looking for. Um, later on that night. I ended up um, going after a Nook Miles stamp, angling for perfection. I was really close to the 500 mark, so I just went up and down the ocean and fished. Um, I actually caught a second one, which is now in my uh, storage in my house. I also caught, and I don't know if I got this on camera i don't think i did but um i caught another new fish which was really interesting uh the barrel eye this thing looks really cool i've seen this in um deep sea documentaries um the top of his head is completely see-through because it can only look up and um the old, like it just evolved to have that feature because i guess it didn't need it because it only lives in the very depths of the ocean. Um, pretty freaky. We got another nook. Um, oh, wow. Hey, getting my nook miles back. Dang, 2,000. That's a lot. That's a lot of nook miles. Cool, look at that. We got a, a pink bud right here. We got another one right here. Oh my gosh. Um, yes, yeah, so it did rain yesterday. So I didn't have to water anything. 
So that definitely helped with all these hybrids uh, popping up. You can see up here, what in the world? Oh, cool. They brought that back. I really didn't think that they would have brought that back, but they did. That's really cool. Um, we're going to have to go find that after I catch this fish. There is a fish that I saw. It was another kind of goldfish. Um, but it was huge. But it said um, it was still a small shadow. It was a, it was a chunkin' goldfish. I forgot what it was called, but um, I think the reason why I haven't found it yet is because it's one of those um, time-specific uh, spawns, like how the coelacanth is only during raining weather. This one is a specific time of day, which I don't remember. I think it was like early morning to four. I'll have to double check that. Don't quote me. Don't at me. So that's one thing I do not need is clay. I'm good on clay. And um, because I'm so short on stone, um, we might have to visit some islands. You know, get some, get some quick and easy stone. Ooh, we got another hybrid. Um, I rearranged some flowers up on these cliffs and you can see we got a pink one growing right there. Ooh, another fossil. Nope. Come on. There we go. Awesome. I like my, my, uh, character, the way he looks. Um, I think these are... I don't know, actually. I don't remember. Let's dig that one up, just to see. I'm not familiar with the stems just yet. Tulips. So these are all tulips. Um, I just... And any of the flowers that were already up here, I just kind of put them closer next to each other to, you know, increase the chances of um, breeding. Or, you know breeding for a hybrid so so yeah money rock give me that money okay um last night late last night i think around 12 um i found wisp and he was making me mad because I couldn't find the last piece of him. I was getting frustrated, for real. Um, but I ended up getting, what did I get? I chose something, instead of um, the option to choose something expensive, I chose something that I didn't have. And um, did he give me the silver mic? No, no, he gave me a... a um, I think it was a wallpaper this time around, and I forgot what it was. Oh, a pastel dot wallpaper. So that's what he gave me, and it it looked pretty good. So I just I just kept it. I thought if anything, um, my uh my wife might want it because she likes all the pastel stuff. These are these are roses. Um, whites and reds. I think there's some yellow there too. Um, are these the wind flowers? Yeah, I just, um, I did a lot of planting. And, you know, take advantage of the, um, the rain, too. Look at that! Another one! Yes! And another one. You know, take, take advantage of the rain, because, you know, it, it, um, waters all the flowers. Let's see. And I think, I think these are the wind, wind flowers right here. Um, I had bags of orange ones. Um, so these are all, I think these are red and white. And then I have orange 
I just decided to drop some over there. This is all... I did all this for a part of Project K. Because Tom Nook wants me to do all this crap for him. For DJ KK. KK Slider. K Slides. K Slides into them DMs. <sighs> um, I think that's it. I don't know where I want to... Let's see, I got four fossils. You know, I'll put that wind turbine. Because I think that's what he's gonna... Um, he's really gonna... The next thing that he really wants me to do is put stuff on the island. Which is why I put that fountain, the street light, the stone arch, and here... The wind turbine. Um, so maybe I should put that on the. Yeah, I'll put this on the topmost part. I think that would make more sense. But yeah, um, I just kind of feel like of all the things he was wanting for uh, Project K, I was thinking that the whole items on the island was what I was lacking. So, we'll move this up a little bit, and we'll push it over one. Cannot grab it from this way. Let's do that. Oh, uh, let's push it up. Or pull it. Bob it! Pull it! Abuse it! Okay. Got another stick. Okay, so we got, um... Two more things here. Marcel? Yes. I moved Marcel's house. This is an empty plot of land. Another empty plot of land. Another empty plot. And this is going to be Jacques, I believe. You hear that? There's a balloon. Wherefore art thou, balloon? There it is. I forgot it broke. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Let's see. Nani? Oh no, it needs softwood. For real, oh no. Crap. Oh, I'm not gonna catch it. Oh. Uh, will it despawn? Hmm. Curious. Let's see. Swiftly, like the fox. What does the fox say? Let's see. Oh, that's what I got from, um, Wisp. Um, Softwood. Softwood? Softwood. Hurry, 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 hurry. Crap, hardwood. I was wrong. Um, um, Oh, fine, I'll use a... I don't like using a full thing. I like using one if there's use, but... I don't have enough. Go! I feel like the balloons... are a lot more common in this game. Um, clump of weeds... Put the rocks away... Gonna sell that. Do that. Open you up. Up. Did I say a beret or a barrette? I'll have to see. Go. Run, 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 run. Did it despawn? I don't think I took that long. I probably did though. Maybe it, oh. Oh, I thought I heard it. I think I just heard um, the breeze from the ocean. Who are you, Jacques? Hey, that's a cute house. Nice. 
my um, hipster burb. I think I missed it, y'all. Oh well. Man, I'm a failure. Um, let's go talk to Jacques. Jacques Gusto. Ooh, he collects metal? Hmm. Okay. That's weird. Oh well. That's... That's their... Thing. Um, yeah. I think that, uh... It's a lost cause. Oh well. Oh well. Let's dig this, dig this up. And then we will go to assess these fossils. Oh, Blathy. Wood block stereo. I feel like it's never anything interesting. Oh, Blavi. So it looks like this time I got four. No five. Um, it says fossils. And I do want to see where the barrel eye. I f more than likely it's with the um the coelacanth and the the football fish and the oarfish. Let's see. Make a donation. Hopefully they're all new. Oh mammoth skull. Right quetzal wing. Now I do know we had the left. Archelon skull. Iguanodon tail. Hey, I wonder if that completed the Iguanodon. Let's see. Cool. Um, let's go check out the barrel eye. Real quick. Hey, this is the first time I've seen a villager in the museum. Yeah, I sure was. Nice. Now, hmm, because my wife does not have a coelacanth, and I have one left over. I'm wondering, I should still be able to donate in her museum. Oh, you see it? Oh, here we go. Look at that. It only looks up at the sky. That is so cool. That is too cool. Ugh, they're getting closer with the lawnmower. Ugh, I apologize. Go away. Go away. I don't want to, I don't. I don't. No me, no. Let's see. Oh, they're right outside the door. It looks like they're on the other side of this wall. Oh, that's the leaf blower. Yep. You hear that? Great timing. Thank y'all. That's what I've wanted. Oh, what's the matter, Buck? Maybe you lost this. Oh, okay. Or are you gonna give me something? What you gonna give? Portable radio. It's not like I've only had 50,000 of those already. Drop something. Ah, yes. Ah, give me more stuff, Buck. I'm gonna run you dry. A raglan tea. 
Let's see what that looks like. Hey, cool. Um, a beret. Yes, not a beret. A beret. Cool. Kind of like that. I think I'll keep that. Have you ever heard of um, Trevor Wallace? <laughs> Every time he does his uh, college skits, he's always wearing one of those kind of shirts. Um, let's go sell this stuff. Let's go. I still want a Luigi hat. I would like to sell. I kind of like it. Uh, yeah. I'll sell it. I think Steph, because. I think I got a mammoth skull from Stephanie. So, ooh, cool. I know I have one of these, but I only have it in black. So, macrame, that's kind of cool. I know I got one of these. Is that a Tesla? Yep. One of those Tesla balls. Please stop with the leaf blower. I don't like it. Um, a lemon umbrella. Umbrella. Let's see. Hyacinth, Cosmos, red, and yellow. Hmm. I like the pinks more than the oranges. Um,. Just, just one. And all of these are the same. Okay. Now that I bought all of that stuff, take it back. I did want to keep one, this hexagonal, because I feel like that'd be a good one for the bathroom. Um... Raglan T. I won't need that. No, no, no. Cool. Oof. I was at a uh, seventy thousand. Okay. And that's just with um with that store. I gotta go to um the tailors. I gotta talk to uh, Sable. She has to be my best friend. I hope that feature is still back. Oh, come on. Talk to me. Hmm. Are those, did I just see flip up shades? Let's see. Dotted raincoat. Uh, I wish it wasn't dotted. Cool. That's nice they have jerseys. Um. I'm old school. Painter's jeans? Hmm. Rain pants? Okay. That's kind of cool. Oh, what? Oh my gosh. What is this? That's silly. Bunny ears, okay. 
cool. They have some fedoras. Looking fancy. Some Chun Li buns. Whoa. Butterfly shades. Huh. A reflector. Like. Like a doctor's thing or something? Stick <laughs> What? What is that? Oh my gosh. Look how goofy I look. Just having random things on. Oh my gosh. Oh, Steph would love these. Mary Jane's. Other sneakers. Oh, they even have high tops. You know? I'm really not liking these. Like anything. Maybe the fedoras, but I think I missed. No. I think I'm good. Like, I know I should, you know, for the catalog, but. Nah. I think I'd like to be more focused on, like, the furniture. But it's still worth a shot. Um, let's see what we got. Um, let's go put these in the house. And we will go talk to Senor Nook. Because... I think you might have something special for me. Put all this away. Let's go see what this looks like. I guess that could work, but I think I like this better for a bathroom. I'll keep it just in case. I need a second opinion. Let's go talk to Senor Nook. Hey, we're getting more inquiries about the campsite you helped build. Yes, yes, my plan to draw visitors easily where the campsite has proven itself to be a masterpiece. We've laid the groundwork to increase tourism and, I hope, the number of island residents. Now, if that positive word of mouth marketing about Talafofo would just spread. I admit, though, this is the most difficult part of our whole venture. Don't worry, Mr. Look. Mr. Nook. <laughs> Mr. Look. <laughs> as long as we all work together, I'm sure we'll reach our goal of having KK hold a concert here. You feel the same way I do, don't you, Edward? I bet it'll all work out. Isabel, Edward, thank you. Thank you so much. I'm more determined than ever. We're not done, Edward, and we're all counting on you. When you're ready to talk about the next part of the project, come ask me what should I do. Okay. Cool. Iron Nuggets. Cool with that. Oh! Campsite. Waiting for visitors is okay, but maybe you're interested in taking a more proactive approach. If so, you can use YES! Amiibo to invite guests to the campsite with the new service I've added. You can access the service via the Nook Stop. It works with an Animal Crossing character's Amiibo. Yes. I am prepared. Very prepared. With these. All of them. Um, one that I'm actually super excited about, which I do want in my town, is Maple. Maple to bear. Or I guess a cub is what that one is. Another one is 
Octavian. That's the name of the octopus that I cannot remember was Octavian. And the female one, which I don't have, unfortunately, is um, Marina. She's a, a pink octopus. So totally ready for this. Now, I have a lot more than 10 in that stack. So I think some people are going to have to get cut. So let's see, let's do it. Let's do it, who do I want first? So let's see, here I have Boots, the alligator. Uh, kind of a terrible name for an alligator. Um, we have Maggie, can you see that? There we go, got Maggie. This one, this one I'm kind of at on. This is Marshall. He just looked cool. Whitney the Wolf. The Wolf. Kiki. One of my um, favorites from OG Animal Crossing. GameCube. We saw Maple. Of course, a lot of people's favorite. Bunny. I was so happy that I had a card of her. Um, Another one of my favorites from New Leaf, Kabuki. We saw Octavian. I got Rosie. See that? Rosie. She's pretty cute. Goldie. Super excited about that one. Her. We got Walker. Another dog. Another doge. Molly. The Quacker. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, she's a mallard, I think. Not a duck. Could be wrong. That's okay. And Peanut. The squirrel. So, that's who all we're working with. But I don't know who to do first. Um, now this stack is very female character forward. So, maybe I should do a male character first. But, the question is, who? Um, so my male characters, I have Octavian, Kabuki, Walker, is Boots a male? I don't know actually. Um, and Marshall. So, you know, let's do... Hmm... Let's do Kabuki. No, Octavian. I have to. Let's do Octavian. Yes, I do. Let's see. That's Octavian's amiibo. Would you like to invite him to the campsite? Yes, I would. Whoa. What's going on? It's Octavian! Oh my gosh! Nice to get a call. I'm guessing you need something, am I right? Campsite, eh? It's so sudden, but why not? I got no other plans, sucker. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited. Nice. Now, does that mean he's over there now? Hmm. Let's go find out. Because whenever I did pass it, it was empty. There was no uh, tent there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Is it really? Yes. Oh my gosh. Thanks to you inviting me, that is. Thanks, sucker. Look, he has a little thing on his head. Campfires are a big part of camping. You can roast all kinds of yummy treats over a campfire. It's all part of the experience. An iron wood table. You want me to do that? Yes. Do you have the recipe? Yes. I'll do it. 
bring it on. I'm leaving tomorrow, so I really hope you can make that item for me today. Oh, I got you, fam. Tomorrow? Or can I do multiple in a day? Um, if I can, I would probably do... Let me put Octavian off to the side. Um, I'll probably do Goldie. Or Bunny. Let's see what it takes to make a, uh... Let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's craft. An iron wood table. That's good because, um... That's another in the Ironwood series that I don't have. Let's see what it needs. Iron and wood. Okay. Easy enough. Let me get some wood. Regular wood. Um, let's do that. Let's go here. Can you see my... Um, did you see my... Uh, right in the background? My barrel eye? It's so cool looking. I knew I had to have one. And then I didn't know this about the tanks, but you they have like individual lights. That's really cool. That's awesome. Alrighty, let's go give this to Octavian. I guess the question really will be is if I can invite more than one in one day. That would be amazing. Cause I think did I have three plots to fill? Ooh. Yes. I sure did. Yep. Can't get much better. You're so quick. As a thank you, I want you to have my rainbow sweater. Okay. You being this nice to a crank like me. <laughs> from off island kind of makes me hate to leave did i surprise you by revealing my sentimental side sucker this is why i liked octavian because his outward projection is more gruff but he he's a softy he really is when I first got here, I felt like a tourist, but folks here are so generous and giving. I wish I could return every favor. They've really made me feel at home. So much so that I think I'd like living here, sucker. Then live here, please! That idea ain't half bad, but I don't know if I can make up my mind just yet. I got it. Invite me out to your camp again. I could use a little more time feeling out the island, sucker. Oh... Does that mean? But, but, but Octavian. Oh, I'll come back in a little bit and I'll talk to him. I feel like that's um a one a day kind of deal with the um amiibo function. Let's see. Let me get another one ready. I need to find out if is Boots a a male or a female? Um. Oh, but Maple's so adorable. And Molly's adorable. They're all just so adorable. I'm gonna do Maple. Maple's adorable. She's too cute. Let me, um. See what I gotta do. Ah, yes. It is a once a day thing. Wow! So, am I going to have to invite him on another, a whole other day before I can get him? Oh my gosh. That kind of, that's a little bit of a bummer. I'll come back, Octavian. Huh. That's kind of cute. It's from Octavian, so I will wear it. Let's see. I wonder. Let's 
see about, um, well, let's check the map. So it doesn't show the empty plots. So I have four empty plots. Well, one of them says sold. Oh, Margie from the island. The um, It wasn't a rhino. An elephant. It was an elephant. Crap, so I, on I do only have three plots left. Well, looks like some of these current islanders are going to go under the microscope. Oh, man. How am I supposed to narrow down over ten down to three? Or, I guess right now, two, because I'm really banking on Octavian. I don't think I could do that. Did I get this rock? I don't think I did. Cool. Not too many stones in this one. But there are stones nonetheless. And I will take that. Do I have my... I do. Cool. Oh. Well, I need my ladder first. I'm gonna have to water all these. You know, get them going. It's kind of like the water, you know, turns them on a little bit. Cool. Um. Let's do that. And come over here. Um, looks like something is growing, but it looks like it's another white one. Let's, uh, I'll go ahead and I'll jump ahead after I'm done. Water into plants. Okay, I think that is it. All of it. I really, man, I guess because it is such an easy process to get them here, maybe they did kind of put a, I guess a wall. Oh, look, he even put the table up. Um. I guess they kind of put it on a a wall before you can actually get them, which is, you know, having to do it three times. Ugh, that's too much. It's at the much. Uh... Ugh. Well, let's see. We got Sherry, we got Buck. Um, we're gonna have to move another neighbor. Oh, actually, no. Let's do an incline. Oh, no. We need to see what... Because Tom Nook wanted me to do other crap. Let's see what he wants. The next step. Let's see. What should I do? Oh, I'm on the last task. We started gathering feedback from folks on and off the island. Our focus right now should be improving the image of the island and gaining that all-important word-of-mouth marketing. I've asked Isabel to assist with uh, collating the feedback, so talk to her for the latest information. I think Isabel will have some good news, or some good pointers on how we can improve the island's image as well. In short, we need to increase our population, improve the island's scenery, and turn Talafofo into the most charming island it can be. Infrastructure is important, so let's plant flowers and use decorations to make this place look snazzy. Well then, thanks for your help. So... do I... 
Is that the paving? Or is this the terraforming? Great to see you. Oh, of course, as Mr. Nick mentioned, I'm leading a task force that compiles feedback related to the image of our island. Oh, so this, is this like the, the thing that goes towards the perfect town? Like how you get the Jacob's Ladder, maybe? Okay, it's just me. Though I have always wanted a task force of my very own. Anyway, I won't bore you with the details now. But feel free to ask me about island evaluations anytime. Yep. That goes towards the perfect town. Let's see. Collects and analyzes the data for my reports. First, I conduct random polling around the island with residents, visitors, and tourists. Their feedback is then ranked using the well-known five-star system. The better the balance of natural beauty, development, and decor, the more stars the island receives. That means we need more residents and buildings, proper infrastructure, and a well-decorated natural setting. Easy enough, right? But if we can achieve the, that perfect balance and welcoming environment, our ranking is bound to rise. As it's said, oh my god! I don't think it was that bad. One star? Oh. It's a place I've been quietly watching. It's a secret to everybody. I don't want it to be famous. Well, there you have it. It seems like every piece of feedback we've received is from the same poll. Poly. And while I'm happy to hear they enjoyed themselves, we need more residents to get some word of mouth going about our island if we want a higher rating. For now, I suggest we focus on growing our population and gathering more varied feedback. Oh, okay. But still, one star? Oh, crap. Ugh. There aren't any ghosts around. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh! So... Oh, maybe they added new things? Let's see. Spiky fence, vertical board fence. These, um, I'm just wanting the recipe for. I'm still looking out for that, uh, the simple fence. I think it's my favorite so far. <laughs> the spiky fence is like post-apocalyptic kind of deal. Okay. Yes. Okay. This is all the same. Oh, so maybe they didn't really add anything. She was just telling me to use these. Okay. Okay. Maybe, um... Because I thought I was really close to, like, the terraforming. But I guess not. Because if anything, I want uh, um, I want the paving option. Ooh, that's cool. Telescope. I'll do that. Place order. K.K. Moody, I do not have that one. Green boots. Oh, green! Yes. That's what I want. Chino pants. Ooh, let me see what else they have first. Ooh, that's a throwback. Sporty shades. Ooh. Pink. Did I already get the chino pants? Oh, crap. Oh! That's where they are. Okay. So these... These came about because... I... Thought in order to get the whole... Amiibo functionality... With the campsite... 
I thought I had to have used it on Harvey's Island. So that's where these came from. Um, man, this sucks because I do not know what I bought. Whatever. Oh, okay. Well, that's the decision for me. I guess that's it. Let me, um... Oh. Oh. Let me see if he says anything else, I guess. Okay, so the last step is PR. Okay, so I need to get to a five star. Oh. Okay, let's do infrastructure. I know I want a bridge. Yes. Build a bridge. I think I'll keep the same bridges. Now there's two places I can put it that I know of, like for sure. Um, one of them is over here. I'll put it right here so I don't have to pull volt over. So this is, putting it right here would be strictly convenience. Or, I can put it over here, and this way, I can put it um, right here, and the villagers can go back and forth to these parts of the island. Um, I don't know if it'll let me though, because I can't terraform. Let's learn these real quick. Okay, now let's, it, it'll probably say I don't have enough room. Wait, what? If, a, if I place structures too close to each other, it'll block the flow of traffic. Better choose another, another place. What if I do here? You need the river to be just the right width. Ugh. Well, I think for now, I might have to put it, um, yeah. It looks like for now I'm going to have to put it over here. Oh, hey, Tabs. Yes. I'm going to help you, okay. In what way? Make a powerful spot somewhere on the island. Just a big, powerful center of good vibes. This is the fabest of fab ideas, don't you think so? Okay. Something like this. Okay. Really? That cassette player gives off strong vibes. Okay. Whatever you say, Tabs. Let me imagine it. That looks good to me. Cool. So no, I have to pay for it. 228,000. Oof. That's a hit to the pocket. Man, I just, um, how much stuff are they wanting me to put out? Skill. 
Hamilton. Oh. Huh. Well, you know what? Or... Can this be a thing? No. Let me... There. Maybe she's right. What am I doing? I can sell that. So that. Um, what broke? Oh, my fishing rod. I think. Yes. That's done. Move that up here. Okay. Um, let's go tell Nookie Poo that we put the bridge. Come on, there we go. Alrighty. Um. Well, I think. Crap. Okay. So. Will you let me do anything else? Infrastructure? Um. Okay. Um, nothing I'm good. Let's do back to infrastructure. Layout change. Island home, the shop, museum, tailors, campsite. Mm. Well, I guess, um, I guess from here it's all Isabel. So. I mean, uh, man, I have so many flowers up. What else could they need? Let me go ahead. Like, you know, I I don't want my, like, I want a five-star rating. But I don't want my island to look like it just has a bunch of crap everywhere. To get to that five-star rating. Um, I know one thing I can do, what they talked about um, whenever it first started... I can put, you know, maybe that'd be a good, use that mic, outdoor bench, um, another one that I can do, I think it takes regular wood, so let me do this, and I need beehives, okay. Let's craft something else. Um, Cause like I said, you know, I I want that five star rating, but I don't want a whole bunch of crap on my island. Let's see, let's see. What am I looking for? Um, what am I looking for? I have confusion. Oh. This, uh, beehive. Can I make two? Crap. I'm missing one. Oh well. Um. 
Let's see, any of these that can go outside? Bamboo baskets. We can go outside. Well, any of these things can go outside. It's just, I want it to make sense. Oh, I can do a few of these. Have little sitting areas. Cool. Um, let's go put these out. Now, as much as I hate to agree with Tabby, but she did give me this idea, so thank you, Tabs. Um, since we have this boom box here, what I can do, I can move this over, and I can put the mic right there. That way, it seems like they're singing to the music. Yes, that's cool. I don't know which way is facing, this way. Okay. Cool, so it's kind of like a performance area. Um, right here, I can put that outdoor bench. I don't know if I want it this far. Um, let's bring it just a tad closer. That way, there can be room to run on that side. Nope. Okay, that's gonna have to do. I think that is even. Okay. Cool. It's kind of working out. Is that a... That is, you see that? That balloon coming on in. Um, what else do we have? Beekeeper's Hive. Stone stone stools. Okay. I want to put a Beekeeper's Hive right here. Wait. Okay. You know, kind of go with the whole... Look, and there's even a, a bee right there. Um, kind of go with the whole gardening look. Let's go get this present real quick. Come on. Oh, see, this is why we need the bridge. Is it already over land? Did I miss it? Where'd it go? Okay. Hold on. Are these things like a lot faster than I think? I have confusion. Was it leaving? Oh, there it is. Oh my gosh. Wow, these things move a lot faster than I thought. I don't know where it is. Oh, I got it. <laughs> I sniped it. That was a 360 no scope. It's gonna go rain my montage. Um, stone stools. So, where can I put those? Probably by the beach. Next to, um, the house. Maybe on the beach. Yeah. 
Like, that's good. I like that. Alrighty. I really don't think there's, um, too much left to do. Um, tomorrow, I'm gonna have to call forth Octavian again. Who knows, maybe by tomorrow I will have chosen someone else instead of Octavian because I do like Kabuki and um, they do both of those are the grumpy nature so I feel like it have to be like one or the other and if I had Marina then I would probably choose Marina over Octavian and keep Kabuki Let's see. Yeah. Let's go sell these. But I think that's it. Alrighty. Well, thank you for watching. Thank you for joining me today. Um, a little bit of a easier episode today, but I hope you'll join me for the next one. Alrighty, have a good one. Bye.